Well, we just had a bunch of fun outside. We had to come in and talk because, man, it is freezing out there. Everybody's hands are getting pretty cold, even with their hand warmers on. So, we took the 700 out, we took the free ride out, and we put, took the rev out as well, the 800 rev that Keely just put together. And the free ride and the rev have both have kits in it from iBackShift.com. Joey put them together for us. So I wanted to do some racing, wanted to have some fun testing. So uh, 700 did pretty well. I've been having issues with my wiring since I took the hood off because I guess you have to have all those wires hooked up. So I'm gonna deal with that later, but we don't have time because we're heading out for Gas Bay tomorrow. But my tack started to work finally and I'm only turning about 7,600 RPM. So I'm gonna get in there and try to dial it in a little bit better. Um, did pretty well, didn't quite really beat anything. Maybe kept toe to toe there a couple times with the 800 rev, but that free ride really hooks up. Joey did a good job of, of setting up that clutch for us. So that's gonna work really well in the snow. It's got that 144 track on it, but that free ride, I gotta tell you, it really hooks up and it hooks up a lot differently than it did before. It was a little more kind of a trail, little boondocking kind of oriented. Now it's set up for the mountains and for the powder riding, so it's going to be pretty good out east when we head out there. The 800 Rev, now it was set up for the trails, and then he put the 156 on it, 16 inches wide, and it pulls really well with the iBack Shift uh, kit that he put in it. It's pulling really hard, actually. So it was really nice to see them all out, all against each other in those kind of conditions. The snow is a little tight, only about, you know, uh, three, four inches of trenching, maybe a little bit more. I noticed it a little bit more with this, it's got a narrower track, maybe 15 inches wide makes a difference, it doesn't hook up quite the same. But you know what, we had a good time and we're loving those kits. Now, really honestly, the testing ground comes when we're out east in 12 feet of powder. That's when we're really going to notice some difference. So, I just thought we'd give you a little bit of a rundown on the clutches and you guys get to see the footage and we had a great time. I got to thank Jamie the cameraman for crawling on the ground and freezing his hands out there for us. So, Stay tuned, a bunch of videos coming from Gas Bay Quebec.